Howdy doody, everybody out there. Hope you're doing good tonight. I'm doing most excellent myself. Uh, almost made it. Uh, Three Stooges card set I told you a while back. I'm, I'm this close, man. I'm like 20 bucks away from uh, being able to pay for that fully. So good to go, man. I'll have it any day now. Just sold uh, my Lando Calrissian figure on eBay for 127 bucks. Yeah! I paid five bucks for it 15 years ago at a Comic-Con and I'd say that's a nice return. Not the Lando you're thinking of from Empire, the one in the blue with the big old smile. No, but uh, the general Lando from the last 17 Star Wars figures, whatever, you know, the last produced ones back in 85. Yeah, I've had it for a while, and it's okay. But, you know, it's not the Lando that I know and love from Empire. So I said, hey, I'll get rid of that. 127 bucks. Skyrocketed. All right, so tonight is Mega Mail Night. Mega Mail uh, I've got several mail days piled up that I haven't done individual videos for, so here they are. They're all piled up. All right, so the first bit of mail is from several weeks ago, probably going on a month ago now. My niece, uh, who knows I love trading cards and my kids love trading cards, she went and she made us a trading card set. So that's not very impressive there, but it's a, it's a message, the title card. It's the title card. It's the message card. And she made... A trading card for each person in our family so here's a trading card and I wanted to give a shout out to her this one goes to uh, to Gabe it's a, a cat with a heart <laughs> this one was for me it's a Hot Wheel fish car because she knows I collect the Hot Wheels right uh, this one is for uh, Jonah because he likes animal crackers or animals. There's a, there's a uh, there's a message on the back for oh man the glare on this well you can't see it but I can I drew a picture of animal crackers for your love of animals. So she wrote, drew a card for each of us and put a personalized message on each of them. Uh, this one goes to my oldest daughter because I was interested in the way you saw bugs, but worms interested me most, yada, 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 yada. So each one of us got a card and a personalized message. Uh, my other daughter, she got a, uh, a praying mantis. <laughs> uh, this is a drawing of a praying mantis uh, for your love of bugs. And then this one, quite possibly my favorite of the group. Uh, this one is called Kids These Days. And it's my wife and the four kids running around driving her nuts. You know, and the word burning through there, it's burnt through because of the ink she used. It says, magic. And it says, uh, dear Aunt Steph, kids can be a real big hassle. That is why I am sending you some magic. Use it wisely or else. I had to tilt there so I could read down because I can't read through these things. So uh, a shout out to my niece Audrey for the awesome card set. Everyone has loved them. I actually made them gather them all back up so I could do this mail day message. So there's mail day part one. And then a couple of the, uh, one of the items I got for my brother for that, uh, that time capsule you saw last week were uh, some miniatures, the the two orc guards or whatever. And, well, it's going to be a real pain in the neck here. The guy really wrapped them nice, so, you know, I shouldn't complain. Really, I won't complain. But uh, I liked them so much, uh, I ordered another set from the guy. So there they are. So you saw them painted before. Now you can see them unpainted. They're lead miniatures. So what you don't want to do is, you know, stick them in your mouth like that. Otherwise... You get lead poisoning! Ah! Oh, death by Dungeons and Dragons! Ah! Oh. I'm joking. I'm, I should be okay. I mean, it's not the first time I've eaten lead. Let's just be honest. Those of you who know me, I probably ate a lot of lead paint chips as a kid. All right, this other one's really hassling me, man. This is probably my clunkiest video yet, isn't it? It's because, you know, you got to open all the packages. And here's the other guy you saw painted uh, last week or whatever in my brother's video. Here he is unpainted. I'm going to leave them unpainted because I like the way they look unpainted. So there's that. Now this mail day right here, this one, this came this last week, and this was a, a mulligan. This is a do-over one, all right? So I ordered this sweet, sweet book that uh, dude Jeff Jackson told me about on Planet uh, VHS Horror because he saw my E.T. collection, which is up there, right? And uh, he put a picture of this book up there and with the pages in it and stuff. So this is E.T., the book of the green planet. And I ordered it. As soon as I saw his, I was like, oh my God, I gotta have it. It's like five bucks on eBay, right? I get it. And the book that the seller has sent me was completely scribbled all over. It's trashed. In fact, I got it in the other room. I'm gonna collage with it or whatnot. 
So I contacted the seller, and being a great seller, as they uh, turned out to be, they said, keep the other book, throw it away, donate it. We'll send you a brand or a new copy. Uh, and this one has absolutely no writing. But, I mean, look at this. Check out the illustrations in that, man. That is just a beautiful book. I can't wait to read this book. In fact, uh, I got a book I'm reading right now. Once I'm done with that, this book is next. I can't read multiple books at once. I don't know how some of you people do that. It's weird. It's weird to read multiple books at once. So this is a, a story of E.T., the book of the green planet. I have absolutely no idea what it's about, but it's about E.T. and uh, the aliens from his planet. So that should be good. Uh, more mail, random mail day. Random mail. This one was great. This one came mm, late last week. My father-in-law, and you can see it right here, behind the Cthulhu cards there, it's a row of DVDs. My father-in-law, uh, he will buy movies, watch them once, and then never watch them again, and just send it my way. Last week, I got Taken 3. I've never seen Taken 1 or 2, but now I'm the proud owner of Taken 3. And man, some of the stuff he watches, you'd be like, really? You watched that? He sent me Titanic. I know what you did last summer. He sent me some real gems, though, too. You know I mean? I've, uh, there's a ton of westerns up there. So uh, every once in a while, I'm just like, really? You like Titanic? Gross. I watched it only because he sent it. And I have it in the, I call it the Kenny collection. So shout out to Kenny for another movie that I would never normally buy. But you sent it to me. I'm going to watch it. And we'll put it in the Kenny collection. All right, now this thing, okay, so I saved this one for last because this one came today, and this one really, it's weird because it's not mail technically. This was on my porch when I got home. Tiny little box with a happy face and all the stuff scribbled out. I am assuming it is one of my neighbors. Get the old scissors here. Or I don't, I, I don't know why this was on my porch. So we're going to find out. Could be one of my students put a, uh, you know, a turd on my porch, and instead of lighting it up, was like, hey, we'll let him open the box in his room and stink it up. I have absolutely no idea. So here goes. If this explodes, then nobody will ever see it because this will not be posted. Because if it explodes, I'll be dead and, ah, crap. Hopefully it doesn't explode. All right, let's see what we got here. <laughs> yes! Thank you, Sue. This, oh, yes. Oh, sweet, dude. Look at this. Look, 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 look. It is a glowing green princess thing. And she's got, wait, she got a little tag on the bottom there. Oh, heck yeah. Look at this. <laughs> oh, man, the light in here is terrible. Oh, here, I hold it further back. Look at this. Oh, it's like, it looks like, I think it's Cinderella. No, it's not. Actually, it looks like a statue of Mary, but in like uh, Belle's dress from Beauty and the Beast. And look at this, man. This is psychedelic. <laughs> Sue knows why she sent it to me, and I know why she sent it to me. None of you know, and that will be the mystery as to why I told her I wanted this. <laughs> Sue Hoffman, that is awesome. Best serial killer dropping box thing off of my porch in forever, man. So, to recap, <laughs> this thing... <laughs> Taken 3, E.T., The Book of the Green Planets, two Dungeons & Dragons miniatures, and a trading card set from my niece in Pennsylvania. So, to everyone who sent me mail that I know, thank you, I love you. And to the other people who sent me this other stuff, you're good sellers. All right, folks, this is running long. You have a good one. I'll talk to you later. And remember, until the next time we do talk, and even after that, and even during that, be a decent person. We got enough dirtbags in this world. Peace!